Welcome to the second tutorial of Hot Ninja Dog Airways Darkness DC3. First tutorial I have shown you some parts of the airplane, some control surface, and now we go to the point what more interesting how to start this airplane. In the first video I have shown you how to get the code dark motors. When you have not seen the first video is okay. If you want to go to the golden dark menu is very simple. Press this, the shift 5 menu, and we come to the golden dark. Then press the button to quit for the checks. The golden dark. Then press the We activate now the batteries. Get the power. Now, uh, not the checklist, and the engine start and take off. So, Aaron, our co-pilot, we know we go a checklist. Before start checklist, parking brake set and checked, doors closed, battery on, ground power, GPU disconnected, generators. Activate now the generators. Then Both on. on. Beacon. Beacon. Is on. Nav lights. Checked on. Cabin signs. Now smoking and last is on. on. Ignition master. master. Activate the magnetos. On. Magnetos. Checked both off. Fill quantity. Flushed auxiliary. Check. Left main. Check. Right main. Check. Right auxiliary. Check. Fuel selectors. So now we uh, activate a few selectors. Simple rule is right to right and left to left. For takeoff and landing, the main tanks. For cruise flight, the shocks are the main. So, right to main to main and left main to left. Carpe. Checked on cold. Trim. Set to zero. Cow flaps. So, cow flaps. Important for engine starts. Must be open. Or we will uh, overheat our engines. Full open. Mixture. Idle cut off. Throttle. So it's going to crack. So a little bit more fuel. Throttle is cracked. Prop control. Propeller coming forward. Full forward. Flight controls. So, like in ac 20 we make a flight control check. Um, in this airplane, very simple because. We have now a hydraulic system for control or fly by wire system for control the flight services. We control it at via muscle power and power. Fly was to this time power. So, check back to the dog. Left. Aileron's right. Aileron's left. Right. Elevator full up. Elevator full down. Rudder full right. So. Rudder full left. So the flight controls are checked. This airplane is ready. You can here also activate, I have shown in the last video, the systems for navigation. Com system. Navigation systems. Transponders. ADFs and distance. So, but working on the mobile control, we are next things offline. You can also activate Nancy to make passenger flies. Do us on board. Like we have here Nancy when we click, we will come to the whole coffee. So, we go to engine start. Important, open the windows. We must run before we start the engine. So, has a clear area or somebody lost his head. So, and start procedure. Full right to left. Okay, starting the right one. Fuel pump. First we need fuel into the engine. On. Starter. Come, perfect. Starter. Yep. Red button. Put the engine. 
So long as they get automatic off. Oil pressure is coming up. See the oil pressure come up, the manifold pressure come up, the RPMs come up. Engine two stabilized. Two flow is also okay, and now go by that say okay, and do stabilize. We can start our engine number one. So we click. Yep. Starting the left. Fuel pump. Maybe one make it automatic again oh. and he hit make Starter. switch to us. Start up. Oh, sorry, the Engine is cranking. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Make some. Oh, fine. Mixture. What is he counting? Not how often they make jet for simple. Late turning. One plate comes one, the next plate comes two. Easy. But for the next level, it's better to move the mouse wheel. Check. Better. Prime. So we're starting now. Oh. Engine one starting up. Engine two starting up. Smoke. As the engine is starting. So we see also why important to say clear warp. When somebody stand near to this engine, he lost his head. So while the menu shift for we remove the shocks, simple press here to set off. And now up Running engines. Go to B4 taxi checklist. Before taxi checklist. Inverters. Oh, we have inverters. Uh, avionic. Door power. Where you uh, must on. Magnetos. Oh, fine. Fuel pumps. Okay, for the fuel pumps. We know we need it next time for the takeoff. Off. Tailwheel. Unlocked. Flaps. Checked. Mixture. Auto rich. Wheel chocks. Off. So, we are now ready for a taxi. Taxi this airplane, simple rule. We control the airplane via the thrust levers, from the left and right engine, or via the brake. We don't have the thrust lever with different engines, like me, different brake. To set it, for example, go to options, go to controls, then we search for brakes. And we simply search it. Brakes left and right. Momento. Sound was a mosquito was killed by me. Never have to kill the mosquito for the way room. Moment, I shall be back. So, just a second. <laughs> Sorry for this, guys. Um, <laughs> was a little bit unplanned. But uh, this girl don't ask to come in. <laughs> so. Yeah, that completed everything. So we can directly taxi now to our runway. 
because we're standing in front of the one way two six left in Ortega, we can now go to the before control. takeoff checklist mixture, auto rich, prop control, high RPM, trim. Trimming is right as we are. Set and checked. Flaps. Checked. Cow flaps. Set the flaps to one four. Cow flaps go no to tail. Set trail. Landing lights. Take over on not 10,000 feet. Oh, fine. On. Peter heat. Checked. Fuel pumps. Ready your fuel pumps. On. Tailwheel. So, at this point, we make before we end. When we enter the runway and uh, aligned with the runway. So, we go to the part the lining with the airplane. Because the airplane is the runway. Close the windows. My opinion is a little better to take this airplane outside of the room. Fast. on the one way so we can see how we drive to learn to drive only with big is complicated I also have a problem with that my personal opinion is a little bit slower is better to handle it. So riding now with the one way not directly in the front of Outside, we make it across here. Locked. Oh. It's at the cockpit. Yeah, press us. Oh. oh, we are waiting for the off. Well, the Douglas DC3 um, is a tail dragger, so slip over for takeoff, press the dows down. Dows come first down, then up. Let's let's see 182. She fly, not fly. Oh, we can no. Oh, wow. Power set for takeoff instruments normal. Some short uh, action on the one way with the brakes. Pressing no. Uh, Ups down. For the reason we want to control via the water. Now we have the water control to align us. V1, rotate. Let's see if we can get this big pony bird off the ground. Positive rate of climb. So, let's see. Push. Get up. So, yeah, we're flying now straight away from the one way. Gears going up. Let's see, the gear down. Time. We are not the fastest. Bird, so you know, go up. Gear up and lock, no bites. This airplane is mostly swimming. So, we'll be waiting a little bit to reach a little bit more important this year. I forgot to activate. Oh. a very long time. Sir, we've been flying with full throttle. You should reduce power. Do you hear it? Our co-pilot complaining about it. We're flying on too much power. The manifold pressure is too high. That's not good for him. So we go to the hostage tank or shake this first. He said our engines. First video has shown you the like it's for the engine. Now in takeoff mode, he 
he said our RPM 2700 have completed. The shank is without also the warriors for the climb rate, so we want now the RPM to 2300, 2500, so we make it fast. Most is as a got 80%. going out of the RPM, use RPM, next point the manifold pressure between 350 and 42, our manifold pressure is at 40, it's okay, we can just lay in the range, and the mixture is out of range, we check now systems, when you check the systems, control your climbing, Sending, or you have a little bit trouble with the earth. See the oil pressures in the green pan, the pressures in the green pan. And then the head temperature and oil temperature is also in the air. So this airplane is perfectly time to fly. Which state you are flying, you can call the pressure. Don't forget, every change in thrust relay change of RPM and changes of different pressure. So oh, we want a little bit we want this airplane and many trimming and also flying and also we don't use our autopilot. Our mothers are the autopilot the pilot this time has the joke every time in the hand. By it by that. So, but nobody here is absolutely this is feel about and won't only take part of the segment. I understand that. So, I will now also show shortly the autopilot. You press Shift 4. Just for this moment, menu. So, the downside. We have autopilot menu. First, we Office, get it on. But number three, we set our altitude at this point, as it's for set it on. And check the shoulder to park cars. Now I see, I forgot to take the smart pass. So, now this airplane will climb to 3000 feet at 3000 feet. Then you are now also switch for nav to GPS. And we can set the heading. In my case, we want to make the pattern. At the moment, so. it doesn't feed the yes, correct. So we're turning now to the lower right hand side, zero degrees. It's also okay. We have also a power system, activate what we wanted. And speed. The speed system works really. But we want to use it. In my personal opinion, I love to buy this because I have a system. We got all outside view. Up. I want to get up. up. So after taking our checklist. Then they also ask it. Here on the long <laughs> co-lights. Flaps. Flaps are up. Landing lights. So, landing lights off. Go to the left hand side, up a panel. Power off. Fuel pumps. So, we have each our normal. The other unit case on 3000 feet. Off. Oh. So, in the next test, we come to landing and take off. So, now it's landing and parking. So, when we first see this video, you are now ready to fly, but not to land. Because the landing is not so complicated. But I will make it a little bit shorter in the video, so the three videos are okay. Uh, what I want to show is when you open windows. Sound. 
this airplane is very nice model. Oh, you see, this airplane is very nice. Make it flying very good. So, I uh, hope you have enjoyed this smart tutorial video how to start the engine and take off the Dutch DC3 and bring it to boost level and how the autopilot work. And you want to use the GPS system. A simple shift six. Anything in my case, I don't know. Okay. It's sometimes a little bit buggy. So I bring the airplane now back in direction for Balontegel for the landing and traction video. We see also E E E. The default system of the CVD and FSX tempo is still active. So nobody was saying something. When you have installed the Mega Airport balloon Brandenburg, you must deactivate the scenery. Our balloon ticket is not flyable. I hope you have enjoyed this video. <laughs> I say it again. Um, thank you for watching, and we'll see us in the next video. Bye.